Welcome back to Nintagus. How's it going tonight? Coulter, how's it going? Anyone else lurking about? Anyone watching offline? Good to have you. Um, you're on. You're probably on Christmas break now, Coulter, right? You've probably been on break for a while, because I know your breaks are, like, a lot differently timed than you usually hear. Uh, we're going to start with Showdown again, I think. Oh, you're not on break yet. Because don't you usually have, like, really long breaks? Okay. We still have so many characters to do. Now, let's do this guy. What are his costumes like? That one's not bad. I think I just like his default one. Yeah, let's we'll do with default. <laughs> Maybe it's just summer that I'm thinking of. Doesn't your summer start like a month earlier than everyone else or something crazy like that? Striker felt a chill run up his spine. After his defeat at the Lich Yard, he wasn't eager to attract attention. But it found him anyway. He surveyed the ambush ahead. Phantom Striker raised his foil, sensing evil magic. Oh, so that's a pretty normal sized break, I think. I know some of our Canadian viewers get, like, two weeks off. So you can teleport with that. I can just like put that out there. No, that's a thing he has to deal with. All right. <laughs> what does that do? <laughs> hey, Volve, how's going? stuns everybody that's standing. I didn't know that. Is that a different victory theme? Why? <sighs> hey, Logan won. Oh, haven't you caught any gameplay of this one yet? Okay, fuck this samurai guy. Excuse me? Well, I'm getting destroyed. It's just a regular showdown, right? I 
can kind of direct those. Ooh. That's so troll. I don't like that samurai guy. Oh, that only lets me- oh no, I can jump super high with that too. And slow fall, okay. Interesting. <sighs> hey, it's this guy. I wonder if you can only play as the dark version of this guy, if you can play as both. Oh good, wind physics. I wonder what the significance of his stance changing after an attack is. Like, eventually he goes back to a full run, but like, does being in this stance, like, offer any benefits? Well, that was stupid. <laughs> I thought I would make it. Oh my god, I hate how they do that. How they bully through your your iframes like that. They're like really good at it too. Okay. <laughs> well, that was stupid. Thought I'd be fine. Oh my god. He like body blocked me and it like killed my momentum and I wasn't able to make the jump. It was interesting. What if it's that these like side characters get their own victory music or something? Awkward party got delayed? Oh right. I think you mentioned that yesterday, but I don't fully remember what you're talking about. This isn't the this isn't the Halo thing on Friday, right? Not yesterday. Sunday? Or did you mention it on Discord? I don't know. No. That triple kill. <laughs> the magnet's so stupid. Not getting like the gems to actually win though. I'm bullying them a lot, but... Hey, knock opponents into lava 50 times. Yay, achievement. God, they can read your parries, too. Like, they know exactly when you're parrying. Still got it. Okay. Uh, my friend has two friend groups and invited a few people from each to a party, but everyone I know is too busy to... Oh, uh, I think I do remember you talking about that. 
Yeah. I think I remember you saying about this. So you said that got delayed and now everyone can make it. I don't know, I'm also thinking about that one lunch, that one, not, wasn't, was it lunch? I don't think it was lunch. It was some, like, you were playing cards and only, like, one person showed up and it was someone you didn't know, and I think I might be confusing it with that as well. Nice. Yeah, I get that. I had- I've had- I've had moments like that. I mean, when I was, like, that age, I had moments like that. Um, now I'm just- now I just avoid being social. <laughs> um, but yeah, I remember having stuff like that in, like, the years after high school, where I was, like, I was- Cause then, cause then you have those friends too that like they invite you, but they don't really like. They're the only ones you know, and you're like, are they actually going to like talk to me the entire time, or are they just gonna like wander off with other people and then leave me to fend for myself? I had that happen once. Where a friend, like, invited me to a party, and then, like, when I got there, they left. Like, they wandered off, and I was like, Okay, I don't know anyone. I'm just gonna leave. And then they were- they got upset because I left, and I was like, I, I don't know anyone here! I'm just standing here, like, doing nothing. And that was like... You know, that was like 15 years ago. People didn't really acknowledge, like, introversion yet, so they were just like, Just talk to people, it's easy! And I was like... I don't want to. <laughs> Nowadays, people get it a little bit more. Still not fully, but more than they used to. Do you get 12 gen- the fuck, okay. More like just have to stay alive. Well, so much for that. You only lost two gems, so no, I lost all of them. Fuck you, game. Now, see, if they used the terminology that they're not willing to babysit me, I would have been like, all right, we're just outright not friends anymore. Cause, cause, fuck that. There's clearly a an incompatibility there. That's a good way to make your friend feel like you don't even feel like, like that, that having them around feels like an inconvenience to phrase it like that.
Oh my god. We have a very cancerous group of uh, enemies at the moment. Let's just say I'm, I'm gonna just stay here. I'm gonna just stay right here. Yeah, that's true. I do that too, Logan. Where it's like, I don't really say anything unless they say something. Like, when I start drifting away and they're like, dude, what the fuck? And then, then I'll say something and be like, well, I don't like the way you fucking treat me, so... Otherwise, I'm just like, I'm just gonna move on. I only say something if it's like... Have you ever had a friend where, like, you, you don't really like like the way they treat you or the way they act, but like they kind of won't leave you alone. So you kind of feel like you have to continue dealing with them. Then I'll say something when I'm like, man, just go away. <laughs> when they like kind of don't take a hint, I guess is a way of putting it. Okay. I really dislike how you can get just bullied into, cl into pits, like, so easily in this game. Oh my god, I can't believe I just did that. That was- that was my own stupidity, though. I'll- I'll- I'll give it that. Try and get more of those without actually falling in. Oh, you're trying to beat Mega Man X? <coughs> oh, Vile? Yeah, Vile's not sick, though. It's kind of interesting that you, like... I'm curious how, what made you think he's Sigma. Vile's only in, like, three of the games, whereas Sigma's in all of them. <coughs> They don't say what Vile's name is? I'm pretty sure they do. If they don't refer to him by name, his name's like at the top of the text box at least. Is King Knight just dead? Yes he is. Because <laughs> that was a limited life one. Got it. That's right, because like every time I play <clears throat> or watch the Japanese version, I see that it, his name's Vava, and I, I'm always like, oh yeah, look at that. His name's Vava. I forgot.
Yeah, his Japanese name's Vava. Oh my god. <laughs> Fucking iframe locks are unreal. I think part of it... This is interesting, how this works. I guess it makes sense. I think your iframes cancel as soon as you attack. So all they have to do is, like, read your inputs and see, like, oh, he's about to attack, that's gonna run his iframes out. And they just have to sneak and attack in first. I don't know if Vile's supposed to be taken super seriously, no. He's not like a super intimidating villain or anything. If anything, he's just a... He's there so that you can get stronger and beat him and be like, Oh, look at that, I can beat him. Except you still fucking need zero to beat him. In the end. Man, so I muted my phone today before I went to sleep because I've been getting a lot of solicitors calling lately and it like constantly wakes me up so I was like, you know what, I'm just going to mute this. Went great. Slept super well. Too well, though. Like, I overslept. <laughs> and now I, I, I got back to the point where I was like, oh, good, now I only have an hour to rush to get ready for the stream, so that sucks. So I have to not let that continue to happen. But very, very bittersweet. <laughs> Just solicitors. Yeah. Striker paced, clenching his fists. He simply wasn't strong enough. The cost of his failures were heavy, and he was far past his prime. I feel like this is the most character development we've gotten for this character. Maybe he got development at some point, I wasn't paying attention. The time for reflection was over. Defeating the source of this darkness would require a champion greater than he. Phantom Striker knew he'd have to find and test an uncorrupted warrior. It was his final hope. of darkness he arises your dark is <laughs> solicitors are like <laughs> <laughs> 
Some people use it to refer to, like, door-to-door -door stuff, too. Like... People show up trying to sell you shit. And sometimes that's what that's what phone calls are, too. They're, they're usually people, like... Trying to sell you something, or convince you to do some sort of, like... Change phone companies and shit like that. <laughs> I think we're we're gonna go jump into King of Cards now, actually. <laughs> okay, so we have Clockwork Tower, Flying Machine, and the Stranded Ship. I think we're gonna do the ice levels first. Some of them are also, though, like... Oh. So you just can't stand still on ice? awful. Okay. Um, I have- I have somebody that, like, must have a phone number, like, one digit off from mine that keeps giving people the wrong number. Cause that's, like, that's another- another problem. I get a lot of calls for, like, the wrong number. That's actually what this one's been lately. It's been like. How do I get up there? Just like that. Um, but they're not leaving a message, so I'm like. I know it's not important, you know? Santa King. <laughs> How do I get down there? Oh, I thought I missed, but then I did miss. Okay, that happened. <clears throat> yeah, I don't answer it either, but still the ringing wakes me up. Like, just the, the phone ringing is like, that, like, that'll wake me up and then I'll... It just screws up my sleep. So yeah, I just muted it today, I was like, fuck it. <laughs> no, it's never anything important, it's never anything for me, so I was like... Why do I keep torturing myself with it? Oh god, I don't like this. Because <laughs> you just can't stop. And it's auto scrolling. I'm just gonna get out of here. That was... That was anxious. I didn't like that. That's why we do them. That's why we do them the ice stages first. Um... But you 
get a huge spike of dopamine when you get attacks. Yeah, I'm not I'm not a big fan of of phone calls myself. Even if it's somebody that I know, I don't like answering the phone. <laughs> These always make me- these- these sections always make me nervous. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. That was an accident. Why, Logan? You ever had that thing where you're like in the same house and they text you? on ice? You mean, how do you charge up the master weapons? Or maverick weapons? You need to get the... I don't like any of this. You need to get the... Buster upgrade. I disagree with that. You need to get the Buster upgrade. It's... I don't know if you want to know where it is. Or if you just want to know what you need to get. <laughs> If that's what you're asking, anyway. Oh, that's why these sections make me nervous. Because that can happen. All right, so take it easy. I thought you were on break for some reason from from university, or did you only just re just only just start again? Uh, I do, I do need to go up there, because I need to get this snow falling. Excuse me, come on. Yes, Volpe, that's the one. It's a very difficult capsule to get, honestly. I still have trouble with it, like semi regularly. Hell, even I've even have I've blah, I've even seen Twain have trouble with it. He plays that game like way more frequently than I do. Oh my 
Oh, hold up. Found a thing. I don't like the look of this. How did he do that exactly? As bad as I expected. Fuck this guy. Uh, fuck this guy. I'm gonna say screw it to that gem down there. Okay, finally a damn checkpoint. That's a new enemy. Okay. Interesting. Don't like it. <laughs> I was excited for a moment, I'm no longer excited. At least they didn't make this platform slippery. That would have been absolute hell. Cool. We did it. Hey, Flapper, how's it going? Oh, Antoine, how's it going? What's going on? We're just looking out the window at... That's a lot of a flamey bird. Guys. Oh god. Mom's dating the king. This guy is thick with birders. I've never seen them in a frenzy like this. Birders coalesce as we approach the final justice judge. Ominous. Indeed it is to be careful, King Knight. We've come too far to lose our champion. Do I have anything to do here? I don't think so. I guess I can get more upgrades, maybe. But neither of these, like, seem that good. Yeah, and I will say that the, the capsule in Mammoth stage is like, there's not really a trick to getting it. It's just, you just gotta jump and reach. <laughs> There's no, like, if you think you're missing something, you're not missing something. You just, it, it's just really hard to reach. My fellow noble, have you ever seen the Crater of the Void of Darkness? If you've ever brought there, you need be afraid as long as you've used a rejuvenating decree. Okay, I will keep that in mind. Thank you, noble horse lady. Hey, look at that, they just gave me a degree. I already had two, though, so... Yeah, it's like, you're not like... If you're thinking, oh, I have to use a certain weapon to get there or something, you don't. It, it just hard. That's it for the ice stages already? I think I'm, I'm, I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. Yeah, because this is a birder bluff already. So I missed a medal here. 
That's unfortunate because I fucking hated this stage. Um, <laughs> Gotta get them medals though. Well, I know it was the last one. I like it when games do this with, with collectibles, where they'll, like... They show them in a way so you can kind of triangulate where it's gonna be. I am a, a fan of that of that little game design bit. Like, we know it's not here, right? Because this is where, like, the first or the second one was. I do not like these at all. Oh right, I took the the side exit. Okay, never never mind. This is actually probably gonna be really easy to find because I took the secret exit. So I still have like a whole section of stage that I haven't been through. Yeah, I haven't even been here. This is like... Did you ever wonder what it would be like if Hammer Brothers were worse? <laughs> That's these guys. Imagine if, like, Hammer Brothers attacks bounced. That's these. Oh, that almost sucked. It's very uncomfortable. No, nothing? Okay. Fine. Oh, and they can also destroy the snow, okay. Well, and bombs destroy you, so... I hope you're happy. This is what you made me do. <laughs> you know, Kuni confirmed. There you go. You said you only had like two games that you were kind of wanting anyway, right? What was the other one, out of curiosity, that you fi you found yourself wanting? I did not realize I was low on health. Or I probably would have healed. Believe it or not, like... Run like, dying due to running out of health isn't, like, something that's often a concern in this game. <laughs> Not for me, at least. It's usually the instant death taking me out. Oh, you can't attack them. I guess because they have helmets. I guess that makes sense, kind of. It's annoying, but I guess that makes sense. Oh, Fire Emblem, that's right. I gotta get around to replaying that some sooner or later. I think I found that, like... I think what my problem right now with... With with all these games to play is actually that I have a lot of longer games to play. 
And that's like that and that's unfortunate. Like I need more shorter stuff that I can just kinda do like smaller playthroughs. Like I'd like to play Fire Emblem again. That's a, another that's a huge playthrough. Monster Hunter is going to continue to be long. Getting back to Dragon Quest is going to be long. Like, I want more smaller things that aren't going to last too long. That can be like three or four episodes. I actually find myself craving more games like that. Which is funny because I used to complain when games didn't last long enough. I'm actually psyched that this is going to last longer than I expected. But it's still kind of like... Damn, I want something like short and sweet, you know? Yeah, that makes sense, Logan. The the PC version's actually like really well optimized, but but yeah, that's understandable. And you don't have a PS4 or an Xbox, right? Let's fight him, and then we can say that the polar area is kind of like all complete. <laughs> We're close, friends. Fresh meat soon. Then it's time to see if this journey's been worth it. You there, are those your dogs? I love dogs, but shouldn't they be on a leash? <laughs> These are spin wolves, friend, and only a raving fool would disrespect them. Oh, cute and yet fearsome. They are trained for combat, I presume? We train each other. You seem sturdy. How about I give you a little demonstration? That dog needs to die. <laughs> go. Oh, he's gonna do this fucking spike thing. All right, you're funny. That's that's new. That was interesting, and I'm fortunate that I didn't land on spikes. <laughs> cool. Yay, there's only two ice stages. That's pretty sweet. In before these stages have ice. Um, I have a feeling the flying machine stages are gonna suck. So I'm thinking those next. <laughs> Banger alert, though. <laughs> oh, I'm dumb. Oh no, okay. We're fine. Oh no again. Alright, we're fine. Yeah, these next two tracks both go off. Be prepared. Or don't, maybe it will be more exciting if you're not prepared for it.
They both indeed slap. That was all kind of unfortunate. <laughs> the amazing thing about this track in particular to me, we were talking the other night when you said you had an assignment to, to write like a 90 second music piece, and I was like, damn, that's like... Not everybody can just, like, sit down and do that. Like, you have to be a really skilled musician to be able to just throw something together like that. This music track? The the composer for this game did this on, like, a four-hour live stream. He just sat down, streamed it, and from scratch created this entire track. That blows my mind. Like, holy shit. <laughs> what kind of a god are you? I wonder if you can still find it. Like, I wonder if the archive is out there somewhere. <clears throat> It'd be cool to see it again. Ah, crap. I'm bad. <laughs> Put my socks on for this one. <clears throat> oh god. I wasn't ready for that. Do, 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 do. And I think this is a good example of what Twain asked about. About, like, how hard this game is. Look at this shit. This is fucking crazy. Like, this this is insane. This isn't easy. But, it's all well designed in a way that I feel like you can just kind of, like, jump in and be like, Oh, I got this. It's, it's, it's... There's good tells and everything, so, like, you know what to do. It's not the type of difficulty where you look at it and you're like, I don't even know how to get through this. They have, like, they have very good game design for this in particular, but for these games in general, I think they have good game design for that. Like, that was intense. But it was also totally manageable because I knew what I was supposed to do. I, I never had to stop and be like, where am I supposed to go next? Who locks up a rose must be meaningful to someone. Is this where I'm supposed to use the Decree of Rejuvenation? Is that what they were talking about? What was the name of this place? Oh, I can't go back. That sucks. I hope there wasn't something there that I was supposed to do. Um, ladder Factory? Also, there's an alternate path on that stage, apparently. Okay, that might be tough. Can you not jump? Can you not bash and jump off of these walls? Is that what just happened? No, you can. I'm not sure what just happened then.
Oh, you can't jump off of ladders. Okay, Mega Man rules. Got it. Oh, no. That one was kind of misleading. I, I was gonna say that, like... They tend to embed gems in walls like that to kind of hint you towards, like, where you're supposed to be going. That one was kind of a trap, though. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Now that treasure's just gone forever. I don't think I can really do anything about that. Those... I hate those enemies. Get fucked. Oh my god. Get the fuck out of here. If he respawns, I'm gonna be super salty. Oh my god. Alright, well now I know to just not jump right away. Wait to see if one of those assholes is waiting. No, I'm just gonna go. You can just get fucked. You fucking troll! Okay, we're fine. Those enemies are the worst. Oh, uh, both. Both both Mega Mans, you can't, like... you. If you jump on a ladder, you just drop. You can't, like, jump and get height off of a ladder. Unless you're on, like, the top of the ladder. Like, standing on top of it. That is a good question, Logan. Because it's not like those things, like, break easily, right? That's a very... Seinfeld-style observation you just had. Yeah, because they're made of, like, fucking steel or iron or something. Like, they, they they last. It's not something you'd have to get replaced fairly often that scared the hell out of me. Oh, no. I don't want any of this. Fuck this guy. Okay, we're fine. Do I want to... Do I dare... No, because I can't jump. Okay, never mind. Yeah, we're not gonna... We don't dare. I was gonna say, is there something above that spike wall that I have to, like, jump up to? But there'd be no way to do it, so never mind. No. There we go. Need me the loot. Aren't the propeller rats supposed to be on our side? How the hell? Oh. There. there. Let's say, how the fuck am I supposed to do this? Did you have that observation, like, thanks to the ladder factory here? Because ladders are similar? Like, why would you, like, how often do you need to order a new ladder? That was interesting. <clears throat> that was interesting. Hey, Scarlet.
What? It's game design, and it's good game design, but... They're on propellers. So why is there a track on the wall so you can see where it's gonna go? That doesn't entirely make sense. From a game design perspective, it's genius, because then you know where it's going, but... But it's on a propeller. Doesn't need a track. Oh no, okay. I'm pretty sure I should have been able to grab that ladder. So I'm hesitating because how many I can't see how many medals I have here, can I? Oh, that's what area means. That's so I can see how many medals are in this area. I follow. Okay, so there's another medal here somewhere. Where? Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Where'd that jump come from? What the hell is happening? Where'd that jump come from? Oh my god. I have a suspicion where the last medal is, but I'm just having a hard time- Oh my god, I pulled a fucking Mega Man. I thought I was on top of the ladder, but I wasn't. I was still in his, like... Yeah, I was in that. I was in the get-up frame. And press jump, and then you drop instead of jumping. Anyway. I have a suspicion where the last medal is, I'm just gonna- it's- I'm just gonna say fuck that guy. <laughs> yeah, cause there's the second one. So it's gotta be after this. And where could it be after this? There's only, like, one option. Haha. Ha <laughs> Yay! Bad guys do win medals. I don't care that I've made that reference multiple times in this in this series. That's still a good one. <sighs> Damn! We haven't even been to Clockwork Tower, and we're gonna fight Tinker Knight? Like... No. That's not how it goes. Everyone's training their own fighting the rats. Maybe. Maybe.
this track is also a banger, but we're not gonna get a chance to hear it just yet. Clockwork Tower. We're saving that one for last due to its its bangerness. We're gonna try and get this alternate path first. So yeah, there's an entire alternate path and a metal I missed, I think. No. Okay, we're fine. Well, that's unfortunate. These that enemy is like such a Mega Man enemy. That's totally something from a Mega Man game. Like not in design, but like in their mechanics, like how they operate. Also in their ass holiness. <laughs> that's a that's another Oh yeah, there's there's lots of Mega Man inspiration in this for sure. Just saying that in particular like screams Mega Man enemy to me. I'm bad. Oh, 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 I see. I see it. I see it! <laughs> oh no, this looks all- oh my god, oh stop. Oh no. I don't like this. <laughs> this is super uncomfortable. You know what? That that one can just can just disappear. Hey guy, how's it going? Hey, I did it. Got the metal and the alternate path. Good shit. Good shit. Card chest. Okay. Hello. You muppet looking fellow with your guts man chin. Old hag must have been wrong. King Birder isn't here. He probably isn't even real. How can anyone bag the Justice Crown if they can't even find the Justice Judges? Take this card, I'm done here. Okay. Level three mystery card. Hurls Velger. Clock Chameleon. Onward. Oh, 
Oh, that sucks, guy. Oh, man, and it's like... Only a Tuesday? If it were a Friday, at least I could say, well, at least you have some time off. But... I'm actually not familiar with this particular mix. But it's still pretty bangery. <laughs> How would I? Oh! Oh! This is actually pretty sweet. This is a really good remix. I didn't think they could actually do as good as the original track, but holy shit. How do I do that one? Do I have to do this? And then do this? It said do. Oh no. Okay, we're fine. Not the fucking flying things that are doing their Medusa impression. Not a fan. This is all interesting. This is all interesting, so we want to do this. This is very interesting. It's a very interesting mechanic. Mmm, they're fucking Medusas. <laughs> that I don't like. <laughs> but, what can you do? We good? We good? We good. I don't know what they're supposed to be. <clears throat> Is- are they just blades with rockets on them? Is that what they're supposed to be? I always thought they were supposed to be some sort of tool, but I wasn't sure what. Gyro Foundry. Beep, beep, and beep, beeper, beep. Thank you for reactivating me. Weesh! A talking automaton? If you can talk, then you can repay your debts. Do something, you brass boob! <laughs> Oh, access granted. Heirloom is now available for purchase. Become a damaging tornado that climbs walls? Well, I have a lot of metals, so... Please proceed to the goal warning shoulder bash is disabled. Bum 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 bum. Bum bum bum. It's the fucking... It's the fucking mock tornado. Okay. I'm Meta Knight now. Okay. 
See also uh, Kirby's tornado ability. What are you gonna do? reaching those two medals for some reason. Oh, I'll put you in steerage. The chicken will surely extract some value from your clanking chassis. Input accepted. I love you, master. <laughs> Weesh. Okay. Lots of things just happened. A nut wasn't one of your drivers just arrested not like a couple weeks ago? Is it the same one? Oh, they'll pay, they'll pay off to your off to your class, I imagine. Yeah, imagine the speed run. It's 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 it sucks that you get this ability so late in the game. So, once you get to this point in the game, the speedrun's gonna explode. It's gonna be crazy. Not the same dr- oh my god. <laughs> Alright. Bad things are happening here, let me refocus. This is serious, I know our foe all too well, the ship's on lockdown until we're rid of the enemy. Take out the intruders, I'll try to steer us out of this mess. Oh. Yeah, I can see it now. This, I, this thing is just a speedrunner fucking wet dream. This ability is insane. Although, I'm out of fucking vigor already. I should probably start buying upgrades to that. So I could see them... They probably save all of their money just for valor upgrades and this and this ability yeah if they do new game plus and start with it that's gonna be crazy if they have a new game plus category for this game that's that's gonna be insane Scoundrel, you lout, you socialite. The sky isn't yours to own. My red combed compatriot, how time passes. Tell me now, why did you steal my. Oh shit. <laughs> oh. Rather than take it yourself, you sent this well manicured goon in your place. I hate to ruin such fine foes, but I've seen enough on guard. Whoops. Whoa, dude. What's happening? <laughs> this is such an elaborate set piece. Oh, 
the fuck are the bombs coming from? Oh, right, his ship shoots bombs. I forgot about that. That was shitty. That's what was shitty. I'll be back. Can I just go out here? Okay, good. Oh my mother just started ringing. Can't hear the right side of the audio. Why can't, like, he can fall off the bottom of the screen? I hate shit like that. <laughs> it's usually right, it's usually my right. That was all unfortunate. Oh, you can play Joustus with the robot too? Like, why not, right? It's been a while since I've had a look around. Doesn't seem like there's a whole lot to, to see, though. Oh, we found a rose a bit ago. Um, didn't know it was his. It was just a rose in a chest, and I was like, alright. That's a thing we have now. And it turns out that it's, uh... Yep, it was his, and now and it made him mad. I don't think those things ever become not invincible and, and will kill you. That was fun. Uh-oh. I don't know. Made him mad, though. That's the big deal, I guess. Alright, so we still have to go back there. Fancy shop. Let's go there. This isn't a fancy shop, this is just a mountainous region. It's 
It's this guy. It's the hat guy. Oh, a gold-clad guest with platinum panache. How lovely. Welcome to my fancy shop. I sell only the fanciest fashions. Clearly you're in the right place. Look at that hat. It's positively regal. <clears throat> this is a crown, not a hat. Do you know what that makes me? Delightfully modest? Ha! A peek at my noblest wares, mayhap? That's a lot of money. Give your interface some regal flair, the hot very height of your step. What does it just make the whole interface gold? Professional de design refits the glide wing to better suit you. Your, jo your joust is colors will see fancier backs. The fronts change a little too. Okay. <coughs> Interesting. <coughs> I saw that. He was following me. <laughs> Holy what? I don't have the money. What are you gonna do? Fight me? Huh, I was expecting him to be like, fine, we fight. Oh. Got him. End of the line, you tight-fisted curmudgeon. I'll have your hat if it's the last thing I do. <laughs> I haven't unlocked this guy in, uh, Showdown yet. Excuse me? <laughs> okay, Sigma, get down here. I'm doing, like, no damage to this guy. I'm noticing. This is another banger that you, like, never really get to hear that much of. Because usually the fight ends before it, like, really gets kicking. No, not what came over me. Your hat. I can't look away. It shines and glimmers maddeningly. Just a bit of cabin fever, really. It's hard to make a friend or a sale in such a remote location. Well, it's all very interesting, but I'd better get going. <laughs> I'd do anything for passage on your airship to escape this dead location. Here, let me, let me mend your rope. Here I am, hat in hand, with a new locale. My fancy shop's about to move on and up. Okay. You, right? A lot of things were happening there. <laughs> he brought his whole shop with him? <laughs> oh! What? <laughs> Oh, he lowered his prices. Okay, good. So where is where is his shop? Over here. <laughs> Just replaced this whole section, I guess. Now only ten. Okay, that's a little bit more. Acceptable. I don't think we're gonna do any of that. Actually, let's get the gold interface. Damn. Damn, it's so shiny. Ooh. 
I know I can do that. Oh, now we did that! I forgot this was a thing. What a happy accident. My mind hath cleared as if from a fall. Yeah, sinuses be like that. I get you. Glory to thee, a thousand thanks. Now let us attend to matters at hand. A judicious king issueth forth decrees. May my wisdom temper thee and thy decrees without wish to write one. I, I am full. I can't take any more. But, you know. Good for you getting over your sinuses, because, yeah. I know how that is. I certainly didn't expect him to pick up the entire building and move it. <laughs> um, avoid crater? Hold on. This is what they said I needed a thing, uh, a, a rejuvenation thing. I'm Flower Dolly, I'm King Knight. Cool, so um, do you know anything about hats? I'm in urgent need of a haberdasher. Need a beret. You ever been to the fancy shop? The proprietor is this guy. Neat! Thanks, lady. Why'd they tell me that I need a rejuvenation decree here? I guess now because the, the, the shop is gone. Sees froth and churned with a furious fright, but the void of the darkness gets all in the end. Shall I hasten your final adventure, my friend? What is any of this? Yeah, like, what does any of that mean? Oh. Okay. <laughs> Alright, they told me to do something with the rejuvenation decree here. So I guess we're gonna use one over there and then try to jump in? Or maybe we should talk to the guy first? and agree to the things? I don't know. Discovery. Kinda of like, I don't have anything like that I can throw to get that stuff, can I? I could maybe finagle with the, the frog to go out there and get it, but oh well. Okay, let's do... Ah, oh, you gotta select it like that, and then you use it. <laughs> That's adorable. Don't know why it told me to do that. Alright, let's f f fuck it. What on earth is happening? <laughs> Madam Mieber, you found the fairy glade, my child. Fairies live here in the wild. Now fetch your favorite fairy, see? It's crucial, so pick carefully. Who do I want? I don't know what any of this is. <laughs> Fucking Spectre Knight has little bat wings instead of fairy wings. Oh, I see, they're popping up based on, like, the location. I get you. There's like the King Knight stuff. A 
There's those guys. I don't know what any of this is. They're just like all following me. It's just like a mess of of fairies. Oh, now they're dispersing. I don't know which one I want. She said it's important though. Can I get more information? I should he should should I just go with like the in the the in character king knight pick he'd clearly pick himself right like he'd clearly pick himself and I don't know if I really have like a favorite shovel knight character or anything so we'll just go for that go with that for now Fairy of royalty, how gilded. He doesn't seem too kingly to me, though. Maybe you should pick another fit. So it's like not my pick. Like I don't, I don't get to pick. <laughs> There's a right answer here. No, you just can't pick your own. Yeah, that's what I'm taking away from it, that you can pick any but yourself. I don't know if this was a thing for other... other campaigns. I've never seen any of this before. I'd go with Shovel Knight, but there doesn't seem to be one. I can just return to the map from here. I could come back later. I would assume this is the thing you want to do, but... I don't know which to pick. I love how even, like, the, g the generic NPCs have fairies. Pick Vert? I could do that. The Legend. Fairy of Song, how melodic. It's hard to beat a handheld music player. Sure, let's do that. The ceremony's just begun. Now throw your hands aloft and sing, we hail your newest fairy king. What? No, no, I want to be the king, not that flittering pest. I'm the king. The fairy king, the fairy king, long live the fairy king. That's why you can't pick yourself. It kind of makes sense. Feet accomplished, get out of my room. Okay. So what was any of that? A punching bag? <laughs> I 
God, it's a shoddy bed for a fucking king. It's, I guess that's the joke, right? Mom card. And a King Knight card. Good stuff. <clears throat> oh, that's how you get up there. Okay. Been wondering since the beginning of the game how you'd get up there. All right, that was all an interesting journey. Okay, where were we? <laughs> um, we still have to go back and do that stage again. Gotta do this stage. Yeah, that's kind of the thing at the moment. Okay, do this. Heat time. That was unfair. Assholes. Damn. I want to get up there, though. God, it blows me- like, this remix is really good. It's blowing me away, honestly. <laughs> like... Who do you think you are, Vert? <laughs> Who do you think you are? How do you make such an amazing track and then remix it and have it be amazing in all new ways? H how? What? So far, Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
just has the 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 chip tune uh chip just in his head wouldn't surprise me not sure what happened there the the jump didn't like happen <laughs> made someone mad by saying their main champion on league was bad <laughs> Okay. Who was it? <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Not. I haven't played League in a long time, but... I feel like that's important to know information. It sounds familiar, but I I can't picture anything. That's a name that like is like that the name sounds familiar, but that's it. So if I saw it, I might be like, oh yeah, that guy. Tinker Knight's just, like, trolling around up there. Okay. Oh no. This does not bode well. Oh, he can't trigger the things. Okay. I can, though. <laughs> I just didn't want to go off the cliff. can't do that. Now I know. You can do that, but you can't bash it. Okay. Fuck me. <laughs> I slipped, tried to save it, didn't work. Yeah, yeah, this is the original, the original version, which is... It's a little bit more, a little bit more somber, but it's like, it's still, it's still very good. I've I've been there, Logan. That's <laughs> why so I was saying earlier in the stream that I muted my phone today. 
Because I don't want to be woken up by fucking all sorts of random ass calls. It's just like, you know what? Nah. Instead of complaining every day that I keep getting these random ass calls, maybe I should just take action and then it stops being my fault. I know exactly how I feel about all of this. I don't like it. But again, like, I knew exactly what I had to do the entire time. Like, remember how I went on that whole rant about how, like, I think a game's difficulty is defined by how it teaches you? I would say this game is actually pretty easy because of that. Like, it does a very good job of teaching you exactly what you have to do at every given moment. I don't think I've ever seen a stage in this game where I'm like, I don't know what to do right now. I don't know how to get past this. I'm almost always like, I look at it and I'm like, I know what I have to do. I just have to do it. I'm sure sometimes that's hard, but... Who are you? Are you friend or foe? I'm just passing through this abandoned house. Are you a ghost? I've seen so many ghosts lately. I'm no ghost, but I am a fool. I tried to make men from brass and tin. This time I went too far. Now they have a mind of their own. I thought they would fight for me, but in the end, I hide here. Are you here to take them? No, I can't let you use them. Leave now. Okay. <laughs> He's learned some new tricks. He better have the main trick still. Yep. Oh, except he's not in it this time? What the hell? Mech's a last resort, and in this case, he doesn't need it, it seems. <laughs> He's doing a pretty solid job of, of trolling me into, into pits without it.
That was tough. I see what you're saying. That he should technically have double the health. I follow. Um, it's a little early, but I need a drink, so I'm gonna take a break. It's also good timing, because we're about to go into, like, the actual new area. So this will be pretty cool. Birder Bluffs. That's, like, a totally new area. So I'm going to... Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Quick break, I'm gonna get a drink. Crank the heat up, because it is cold in here. Last couple days, it's been really cold here. But apparently not cold enough, because it was supposed to snow like crazy, I think, yesterday. And none of it laid, because I don't think it was cold enough, so it just all melted. But it's still super cold, so. Yeah, I'm gonna address that really quick. I'll be right back, and then we'll head into Birder Bluffs. We're making pretty good time tonight, honestly. I still don't think I'm gonna push to finish this tonight, though. I think we'll just do this area, and then I'll save the next area for next time, I think. Unless we get to the f to the next area and it's, like, super short. Like, if it's, like, not very big, then I'll just be like, okay, let's just finish it. Um, anyway, so yeah, I'll be back in just a minute. Stay tuned.
Alright. Let's do it. So let's crack my drink open, but hell, let's hear what this guy, this track's got. I think this is the one we heard on that one, like, shorter stage. What did you think of, Logan? What do you mean? Because you just don't know what, like, the second half of 2020 is going to have in store? These don't seem to do anything. You must have to jump in them like, oh, that's not what I expected. <laughs> okay. Because you don't know, like, what college you're going to go to and everything? Yeah, I totally wasn't. I was I was taking you seriously, damn it. <laughs> Which is my fault, right? <laughs> I should have known better. <laughs> Yeah, now, now that slaps. <laughs> now that slaps. I did not expect the tornadoes to be Gravity Man things. A lot of bad things happened there. Yeah, Galaxy Man has those, like, portal things that do pretty much exactly this. I could probably use my charge dash thing and get up there, like, with no difficulties. I don't use that, like, ever. It's kind of a question of why I'm even using that armor. Do they have arrows on them? They're just, like, hoops. And they always spit you out, like, upward. Oh my god, why? I have no... I have... Nothing to say there. Nothing to say there. If I just do this... I 
I'm already speed running, baby. Until I got to this section, now I'm going slow. Why would I do that? Why would I do that? Oh god. I could have gone poorly. Alright. Okay, that worked out. That did not work out. What the fuck is wrong with me? <laughs> At least now I don't have to do the... I don't have to get the medal again, so... That simplifies things. I could! I just tend to forget that I have those things. I guess I like to know how to get through these stages without using stuff like that. That way, if... If I'm depending on the tornado thing, for example, but I run out of valor, then what do I do? Then I'm gonna be like, well, shit, now I don't know how to... I don't know how to finish it, because I only know how to do it with that. Oh. Oh. This is a very Galaxy Man thing. Like, yeah, the Galaxy Man does that. <clears throat> I see what I have to do. Good, good, got him. What is that? <laughs> That's a new enemy. And I don't think I like him. Oh god, no. Just, oh god. J oh god. <laughs> This is very Galaxy Man as well. Except they had the decency to color code the tornadoes so you know where you're going. Remind me to thank them for that. That was that was a, a views nightmare enemy, right? He just stayed up there, up in the sky where I couldn't attack him. He was just like, nah, I'm just up here. Deal with it. <laughs> now suddenly new flying machine. What? God, they don't take, like, any time to recover. This is a very simple remix. 
he didn't he didn't fuck with this one. He was like, nah, we already good. Also, fuck these enemies. That goes without saying, though, right? See, another thing that would have been cool here is, like, clearly that enemy was here thinking, I'm gonna blow him into the spikes. It would have been cool if you could have shoulder-bashed him into the spikes as well to kill him. But no, he just, like, clips right through it. It's like, oh, that's fair. Fucking, they almost, they almost bait you there. That was mean. Oh, I see you. You're replying to me on dis- I don't even remember what you're replying to me about, so... <laughs> yeah, we'll get- we'll get there when we get there. I don't even remember what I said last. Oh, like I said, I don't really intend on beating this tonight. I don't really want to. Like, I want to get at least one more stream out of this if I can. I mean, we're going to regardless, because we're going to play through the other campaigns and shit, so... I just took the pun opportunity, even though it was a bad one. And it was completely unimaginative, and I could have done better, but... Okay, he can also do that. I'm just gonna not. <laughs> How's that sound? You guys wanna just not? How do we... that too. Oh well. Oh no. Fuck. 
Eh, this is one of those enemies where if you try to ignore him, something's probably gonna go horribly wrong. And I don't feel like I don't feel like testing, tempting fate. Also, money, I guess. That was a fairy rat. Just noticed that. The wind changed and fucked me. Now we're just gonna be like, we out. Oh no, it fully blows. By design. Man, that cheap ass garland I have on the tree shed like crazy. What the fuck are you doing here? And who's that? Anyway. There's little specks of garland all over the fucking carpet, and it keeps catching my eye, like, out of the out of the corner of my eye, and I'm like, oh, what's that? Oh, it's just garland. Time flows ever on, Specter Knight, as our grand game proceeding as planned. The contender has defeated two justice judges. They now travel as one headed to the Burner Bluffs. Splendid. Soon everyone will be brought together. I had feared ours would be a protracted struggle, but the justice crown turned out to be the right angle. What fools. Is something wrong, Spectre Knight? Is our cohort making you uncomfortable? Toy with me no longer. Enough of this tangent. Don't be obtuse, ghost. Stray not from your path. Come now, it's time we up and left. Yes, I tire of this foolishness. Leave the Reaper to his task. Soon enough, we shall reveal our hand. Oh, 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 okay. There's, there's, there's things happening behind the scenes, apparently. It's a deathly pale, deathly pale card courier from the plains. Fetch me a drink or clear my path. My leader's power is growing unfathomably strong. If I were you, I'd show us both more reverence. My power has grown as well, and unlike you and your fetid frame, I kneel for no one. Arrogant fool, you will soon learn your place. Will I, though? Oh. <laughs> okay. That's a bit of a problem. How'd that hit me? I thought I had a good plan there. Do, 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 
That's a lot of damage. Oh, the lantern blocked me. You got lucky. Get out of here. Was it like six? Hit? Yeah, like that was a lot of free hits. Enough, the final king lies just ahead. Do not wander from your path. But know this, soon the house of cards will collapse. Choose your allies wisely, and you can still find what you seek. Okay. I guess, should we go do the cards first? I don't really feel like doing cards right now. But I also don't want to completely ignore it. So I guess we should do that first. Okay, so we got... Pompator guy, Tinker Knight, looks like. <laughs> A goo thing, and we don't know who the... Who the final one is. Oh no, it's one of those enemies from Tinker Knight's stage. <clears throat> hey, free card. Oolong. Okay. This is dramatic, isn't it? So I might understand that the last one's Polar Knight, probably, because of the the dogs being here. Alright, have I gotten any new cards that I should be using? A lot of them I wouldn't really want to lose, you know? It's a conveyor arrow, I haven't even seen one of those yet. <laughs> what? What? Okay. I'm just gonna stick with what I'm using. Leo. Let's enjoy a good round or two before I continue pacing about this ca this tavern unimpressed. Okay, dick. All right, so I'm assuming that these are if a card lands on those, it like falls and is just eliminated from play.
Ooh, well played. <clears throat> oh, does it like fill in the pit? Okay. Oh, and then you can place a card on it. Okay. Interesting. Watch, well, well, aren't you a douchebag? Thanks? Not sure what he was going for there, but all right. Oh, you still have to place a card there. Okay, well now you're a douchebag. And there's nothing I can do about it. Shit, that's, that's what he was going for. I can't push that card out. I can't push either of his cards out. I played into that like a like a dumb. I heard somebody say that in another stream that this is similar to a game that was in Skylanders. You took that card of all things. Okay. What if I don't want to go first? Did you ever think of that? Damn, he did it again. Oh, and you do get the card back if it falls into the pit. Okay. I'm learning things. I don't think he can push those two cards off. There might be something I'm not seeing, but I th think we're safe there. The way those arrows were placed, there wasn't anything he could do about that. You can just buy it back, fortunately. I can either- I can do this. I can take it back. And just be like, that's mine now. Again. Or you can go to talk to, Je talk to Chester and just buy it back. Yeah, now the dogs are getting all all hype because I'm winning, I guess. Let's do these these fucking puzzles. How the fuck? How on earth would I win this in one turn?
I mean, I guess I just have to take one gem in a way that he can't take a gem. Which is easy, because he can't place a card on the gems, so I just have to make sure that he can't push any of these onto gems. Which he can't do. How does this- how do bombs work again? After placement... If you push it onto a card, it blows it up. Oh. So that doesn't work, because... It wouldn't actually get me any gems. He wouldn't be able to get any either, but... That would make it a draw, not a... Well, if I do that... Oh, this card just, like, pushes them twice? So I don't want to do that. But then he can push that back down. So that doesn't work. That works. He wouldn't be able to push that. Yeah, but it's- it's one turn in that, like, he gets a turn, too. So you have to not only make a move that will win you the game, but will not give him any moves that he can win the game back. I think it- I think this is it, but there might be something he can do here. Yeah. Okay, these guys are just going overboard with the puns, and it hurts a little bit. <clears throat> you don't fully understand how this works? I'm still kinda coming to terms with parts of it, to be honest. So what does Conveyor do? <clears throat> ah. So when conveyor cards get pushed, they go in that direction? That sounds awful. Like, I hate that. But, okay. Um, well, he would be able to push that, so that's not the answer. <laughs> yeah, I wonder if that's only if you use conveyor, though. No, it's just when they get pushed. Okay. What happens if I push this down? Do they get pushed every turn? No matter what? That really sounds awful. Okay, well, on one hand, this gets me two gems. I don't think this is it, but we're gonna try it, because I want to see what happens. Yeah, because that makes it a draw. That would give us two gems, but he's still in a position where he could take one back, so that doesn't work.
This is what I just did, right? Yeah. You know what? It's hard to see how this is gonna play out, but I'm... No, because those two cards are gonna counter each other. But what if we do it like this? Because then when he takes a turn... It's gonna push me... What the fuck was that? How did he make that his card? Excuse me? Back up. Like, I don't understand what just happened. And they're, they're just, like, not gonna let me... Okay, I can read this card. Hold on. Cascade on initial push. Any card pushed will swap teams temporarily. That's bullshit. <laughs> That's bullshit. Is what I have to say to that. That's interesting. That's not gonna give me anything special. Did I try this? But why didn't the conveyors move? Hold on. I, I don't like these because sometimes the game doesn't play out the way it's supposed to. They, they designed it that, like, there's just that one solution. And if you try to solve it through any other means, sometimes it breaks the rules just to say that's not the solution. I mean, I don't know if... I don't think that would have solved it for me anyway, but it still was like, it, it didn't play out the way I, I expected it to. This one reverses. That's not gonna do much, though. I don't really know what to do on this one. This one is like... This one's super complicated. That's the one where he just pushes one of mine, and since that's not the correct, the, the quote-unquote Oh, they don't really have anywhere to move anyway. What about this? Oh, that's the one where he just pushed it down and turned it into his card, which is bullshit. Um... tried that yet? Yeah, yeah, you can just do that. I don't really like these. I hope this is the last set of puzzles, because I'm like... I liked them until they got, like, this complicated. And now I'm like... Okay, this is not quite so fun.
Is that only reverse? That only reverses when it's pushed. If I do that, he's just gonna push that one down. Undo everything I did, so that's that's not it. One gives me two, but he can easily push all of those out. This this one I'm just I'm just not seeing. This card seems completely useless. Cause it like everything has like there's down arrows everywhere, so th that's not the card. Like, clearly. Because there's just nothing you can do with it. What, like your computer charger? Or phone charger? Haven't I tried? I feel like I've tried most of these moves and they haven't played out the way, like in a winning way. Try this one. I mean, this wouldn't work. He can easily push push my cards wherever the fuck he wants. Like that gives him just free reign. I think I'm looking at this all wrong. I need to be looking at. Just preventing him from making a move. I think. But he currently ho holds that gem, so I don't think that's it either. counter that. This he can easily counter. Like he could just push that one up or push that one down. Wait no, he can't push that one up, but he can push that one down. Other way around actually. Middle one he can't push down. He can push it to the left. This definitely isn't it. Because he could play that, that bird card in the middle. Which would turn my middle card into one of his cards, so he'd claim both those gems. So that's definitely not it. I don't like these. I'm like... Pretty sure he can't take my cards because of one of my cards. Um, I'm not like in the right mindset for this tonight. It's kind of the problem.
That's unfortunate. Okay, so they will convey themselves right off of the map. Okay. Something I was curious about. Yeah, it's not, we just can't do anything. <clears throat> Does that leave him without a move? He has a move, but it's not a productive move. Kinda left me without a productive move too, though. That's that's the joke, I guess. Um, we can do that. What? That flips you even if... Hold up. I mean, I guess that's not a big deal? How long do they stay flipped? I gotta take that card out of my deck, because fuck that. That seems like it probably just doesn't have any applications. I'm gonna do it anyway, because I don't think I can really do much else. We still win, so it's whatever. But, yeah, fuck that card. I almost want this one because I'm not a fan of the conveyors. They're a little too... Not unpredictable, but you have to be able to think, like, so many moves in the future to, to understand, like, how they're going to affect the game. Not... not really a fan of... a fan of those. I don't really like the ones that flip around, either. Again, it's like, it's not that they're unpredictable, it's that it's like... You have to think, like, you have to be able to think very fast, like, several turns ahead to figure out, like, okay, where's this gonna lead? What was it that this did? On placement, all arrows try to push at once. Okay. I think I'm gonna keep that one. definitely a thing where like I was getting pretty into this like I, I feel like this happens with puzzle things like but like puzzle games like this a lot for me at least where like I'll start out and I'll be like eh, I'm not 100% into this and then I start getting into it I'm like all right I'm starting to understand it I'm starting to like I'm sorry I'm starting to understand it enough to the point where I'm having fun and then they throw some ridiculous gimmick in there, and I'm like, I don't, I don't like this. Like, they, they almost, they, they have to get too complicated with it, like, all the time. They can't just let it be a thing, you know? Sometimes with stuff like this, simplicity is, like, necessary. Fuck. 
Remember that part where I said you're a fuck? You're still a fuck. push if I do that does he have a move he does have a move so I don't want to do that I want to do like oh, fuck, I can't. oh well that means he doesn't have that move either hold on I want to force him to have to play in that lower corner and you know what I think he has to I think that's his only option That works too, it, it didn't do anything. Like, whatever. Yeah, exactly, it's like, you have a learning curve, you go through the learning curve, and then you're like, okay, I get it, and then they throw another learning curve at you, and you're like, oh. I liked it when it was simple. I, I didn't need all this all these extra layers of complexity. Those kind of just made me say, oh. Eh. No, I don't like it as much. And in this case, it's the conveyor belts. I'm with, like, with the conveyor belts, I'm just like, mm, yeah, no. Oh, th the wolves themselves are the, are the fucking, the champion? Are you serious? Um, Let's do this first. <laughs> They're all piled up, ready to play. Family staying for a week? That sounds awful. You have my condolences. Should I expect that you probably won't be around too much that, uh, next week then? I really want to block that conveyor belt in so that it's just not an issue. Okay. Congratulations, you did a thing. Um. I don't really know what my move is here. Because I did ask when you said you have two weeks off for... <sighs> for the holiday. If there's anything in particular you want to see streamed that at the, over that time, but... If, I, I'm guessing for that first week you're going to be happy to even be able to watch anything. You're a fuck. You're a fucker, what can I say? What if I do this? Yeah, fuck you. That's what you get. Your ass.
Nice. I was worried it was going to give him another turn to try to counter it. What does this do? After placement arrows, reverse... Oh, 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 so it's reverse. It reverses all of them. These are only reverse, like, vertical. That only reverses horizontal. Okay, that's right. I'll take that, actually. Go to pups when I go for a walk. Do you want to go for a ride? Just bite my cape when I jump up. We still have to go get that... Get the fucking puzzles. I don't wanna. <laughs> oh, I mean, next week at least, we're gonna do that 1 through 6 Mega Man run. It's probably just gonna be a bunch of Monster Hunter aside from that, to be honest. I don't know if I'm really gonna get much going other than that. Oh. Oh, I have like trophies for for beating them. I didn't notice that. You got the puppies hanging out with, with Mona back there. Anything else I want to do super quick? What were these? One upgrades the ship, the other one's card backs. I don't really care about that. Let's upgrade the ship though. Whoa. I like it. Oh, there's another one? I'm gonna want to do New Game Plus on this game, I'm pretty sure. Because it's pretty fun, and, like, just to kind of rush through it, get a bunch of money, and then, like, upgrade every- like, get all the upgrades. It's probably an achievement to do it anyway, so... Yeah, at the moment, tomorrow we're gonna do Pokemon. Thursday we're gonna do more of this. I'm not sure about Friday yet, but it's I'm leaning towards just doing Monster Hunter. Saturday will be Risk of Rain. Sunday will be Monster Hunter for sure. Monday I'm not sure about. I was planning on streaming since I'm planning on taking off Thursday and Friday after Christmas. But I might try and plan to do another uh, speedrun race with Twain that night, maybe? So I might not stream. We, 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 might, we might be streaming over there. Um, and then Tuesday will be the 1 through 6 run. And I don't know what I'm doing on Wednesday. I'll stream something on Wednesday, I just don't know what yet. Um, I'm thinking Monster Hunter, though. And then Thursday, definitely I'll have off. Friday, maybe not. Friday's, like, could go either way. And then I imagine Saturday will be Risk of Rain again, and Sunday will be Monster Hunter. When's New Year's? New Year's is on Tuesday. I'm planning on taking off on Tuesday, but not Wednesday. Yeah, schedule's gonna be a little bit in disarray for the next couple weeks. I meant what day of the week, smartass. <laughs> Couldn't remember if Tuesday was the 31st or the 1st. So, Clock Chameleon 
is not the answer in any world because it can't do anything. It just can't push any of these cards. Like, you can't push that because there's a down arrow. Can't push that because there's a down arrow. Can't push that because there's a down arrow up there. Can't push this because there's no room. Can't push this because there's no room. And it can't push this because there's a down arrow. So that card is completely useless. We can just ignore its existence. It has to be one of these two cards. See, that's the thing. I feel like I've already tried out a lot of the available options, and I haven't found anything yet. Maybe I'm missing something. Like, what does that do? Hold on. That's a move that's like, it's a stupid move, but the conveyors are doing everything themselves. So he can't push... He can't push the Viking out of there. The Viking is secure. I think this is it, actually. The Viking is just there, and he can't... He can't do anything about that card, and he can't push any of his cards onto... any of the gems. I think that's it. Yeah. He can't do anything. Near when I was trying this the last time, I said that at one point. I need to focus more on making it so that he can't do anything. That's exactly what I had to do. I didn't even have to make a move to claim the gems. I was focused all on like that top part of the board. I wasn't even looking at the bottom. And that's and that's where the answer was. Yeah, let it win itself. Not, not even necessarily that, but like... Yeah, it, it, this wasn't the first puzzle we had where the answer was to not make a move. Like, the answer was to just do something stupid and irrelevant. But if you did that, he didn't have any options either. Oh god. This looks awful. Okay, so... Now we have to deal with these Cascade cards. On initial push, any card pushed will swap teams temporarily. So if I do that, it switches that card. If I do that, it switches those cards, okay. Well, if I do that... He's just gonna use the Jellyfish to push that down. And then he claims both gems and wins. So that's clearly not it. If I do this... I can't do that because there's an arrow there. Um, and then this one doesn't... Doesn't do anything. But again, if I do that, he's just gonna push that, so that's that's not it. And otherwise, I can't push anything up here, because it's full, and I can't push anything down here because they all have arrows. So that card is not the answer. Yeah, because that's just a losing move. If I if I do that, I lose. So that's not it. Is it the up arrow? If I do that. He can't use the jellyfish, so what can he do then? But then he's just gonna use that that second card to push it to the right, and he's gonna claim that gem again. So So that's also not the answer. could do that, but then he can just use the jellyfish again, so that's not it.
you can't do any of that because it's full. What other moves are there? I can only push right and up. Most of the up and right options are blocked. That's it. That's it. If I do that, it gives him a gem, but he can't push him to the right, so it eliminates those two cards. He can only place the jellyfish, and when he pushes it, it's gonna f swap teams back and give me two of the gems. Easy peasy. Kinda. Easier than the second one was. The second one was more confusing to me. Truth be told, we knew you'd swim through this webbing of pu sh Shut- oh god, shut up. <laughs> it's actually painful. Alright, well we have all the medals, cool. We can move on here. Happies. All right, Logan, take it easy. Okay, cool. Let's do this. Well, that was a thing. you stop? Oh my god, you troll. Okay. Oh. Oh, because I already used the dash that jump. Okay. I was like, why am I not dashing? Yikes. 
Oh god. <laughs> oh, I don't like these things. They a little too durable for my tastes. Good about that. Oh, I just went for it. That was interesting. I want the gen I want the big gem. Oh god. God, I hate these things. That screwed him up. <laughs> what took you so long, King Knight? I've been expecting you. You're every bit as flashy as I've heard. How did you know my... My name precedes me, I see. Excellent. And you, you must be... That's right, it is I, the final justice, judge, lord, and high ruler of Birder Bluffs. King Birder. Oh, well, hello there. Greetings, fellow king. Let the final match begin. Hmm, where shall we all sit? Sit? You need only kneel before your new master, King Birder, and prepare for an eternity of servitude. There are a lot of things happening here. Oh. I repeat. <laughs> There's a lot of things happening here. I'm glad it didn't kill me. That would have infuriated me. Oh no. There we go. I knew that was a bad place to stop to try to heal <laughs> but I took the chance and it did not pay off how much damage did that do
fucking... Oh, we got some health back. I was about to say I destroyed him that time, because I saw that he had, like, very little health. And then he got health back somehow. And now he's just a normal birder. Oh, it's a D? I thought he was just... I thought that was his true form. Pink birder was merely an enchanted birder, but then who is the final justice judge? Oh. Okay, I see what you're saying. My poor feathered puppet. Oh well. The ruse was great fun while it lasted. King Burner was a deception. What's the meaning of this? Who are you, witch? You may all pledge your loyalty now, for it is none other than I, the Enchantress. Justice Crown was a contest of my own devising. I wanted the kings, the Justice Judges, lured into one place, ready to be controlled. While the world obsesses over a silly card game, I've been amassing an invincible order of knights. It's actually pretty clever. <laughs> <laughs> um, a rogue recruiting evil knights in our kingdoms? Disastrous. I was going to control your minds, but the Justice Crown has already afforded my plans ample time. Can't you see? I've already won. Soon you'll feel the might of a true tyrant. Toodaloo, imbeciles. You must return and warn the others what will become of our kingdoms. What a strange dream. Oh, and new friends are here. Are they the ones that rescued me? Are they talking about me? Can they hear me? The Enchantress gave me a voice. It was her voice before, but now I have my own voice. And I've overheard her plans. Maybe I can help? That's awfully convenient. <laughs> um, now this birder has endured great hardship for his knowledge. Please listen to him. Hop on my back, friend. I'll tell you all I know about the Enchantress. Perhaps with luck, we'll prevail. <laughs> Just riding on him. What the fuck? And so the innocent King Birder shared his kingly misgivings about the Ench Enchantress's evil scheme. King Knight failed to grasp the gravity of the situation. You're back. Our cohorts just told us the awful news. It's all true, the Justice Crown was a sham. The Enchantress distracted us all. We're doomed. Everyone settle down. Your attention, please. Hope is not yet lost. The Enchantress fooled us all, but unfortunately for her, she also brought us together. Our captain is right. We must unify and fight for what we cherish. My kingdom, my Griffiths, my friends at the Triple Pond, and our majestic king. For birders and all those without a voice, I may have just joined, but your angle is true. It's been quite a journey, but our goal is now clear. We can't let the en the Enchantress win. Now who's with me? King Knight just seems like... What is he getting out of this, you know? Like, why is he going along with all of this? He doesn't seem to actually care or have a stake in any of this. Flies close to the tower, fade ahead. This is it, King Knight. We're all depending on you. Alright, so there's not nearly as many stages. In fact, it looks like there's only three. So we probably could finish this tonight, but I don't think we're going to. I think we're still gonna go do Showdown for a bit. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll do a quick clear through normal Shovel Knight game mode. Maybe I'll do that. Oh, that sucks, guy. So now you have like a massive download ahead of you again. I'm going to get these. Because now I finally have, like, medals to spare, so fuck it. Might as well max that out if we can. Whoops. And you said downloading that stuff on your connection is, like, takes forever, right?
God damn, how many of these do you have? Oh my lord. Another one? My god. I'm gonna keep my money for now, I think. <laughs> or... Honestly, Vestments of Vigor sound like they'd be pretty good. I'm not really using this charge, which tells me that, like, I could probably be getting better use out of another armor set. I feel like this one might be pretty good. It's just enemies drop more vigor. Like, yeah, let's, let's go with that. <sighs> yeah, like, we have... I have to go back up here to access that menu. There's still another heirloom somewhere. There's still 35 medals somewhere? Like, where? Oh, it looks like there's some here. I wonder if you get medals from like beating the the guy, ev beating everyone in cards or something. You know what? Let's go ahead and get these. Yeah, I bet you get a lot of medals just from beating everybody in Joustus. But yeah, I think... I don't think we're gonna finish this tonight. Um... Yeah, I think, I think we'll aim to finish it on Thursday. Which actually makes more sense, I guess. To not do a Shovel Knight clear tonight. Because this isn't gonna take me, like... Three stages aren't gonna take me, like, five hours. So... It would make more sense to do another Shovel Knight clear at the end of that. So I think we're doing, gonna do Showdown for now. Keep trying to unlock everybody. You know, at this point, I guess I guess we'll just go through and just just do them in order. I, I still don't want to really look and be like, I don't I don't know if I want to know how to do it. I just want to go and see what happens. You know, I actually like that a lot. It's not terrible. Yeah, I actually like that. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> so yeah, we'll probably do Showdown the rest of the night. Intruders approached, he brandished his shovel blade at whomever was lurking nearby. 
And then, yeah, I think on Thursday, we'll finish King of Cards, and then we'll do... a clear through the... through the original Shovel Knight. After that. Yeah, he's probably gonna mostly just play, like, Shovel Knight, right? Knocked into the lava is so fucking cheap. I, like, accidentally, like, knocked this off of the chain. Last clear? I don't know how I did that. You can jump way... Maybe Shovel Knight could jump this high, too. I don't remember, actually. Oh my god! This is so cheap. There we go. You said it's not too big of a file, at least? Something nice about most Switch games is they're a lot smaller in file size. It's almost like Nintendo tells them, like, okay, none of this fucking 90 gig game bullshit. Like, actually optimize your shit. I think that's a lot of it, and I think that's why a lot of developers do that, say that shit about, like, oh, the Switch can't handle it. I think with all the power they have available, they just don't. They don't optimize their games properly. They leave everything uncompressed. I think that's why Switch file sizes are typically way smaller. Because that's when they have to actually compress things. Put forth a little bit more of an effort. And Shield Knight and Escape, the tower's magic must be responsible. So is he, like, not bad yet? Hey, Volpe, welcome back. Yeah, like, six gigs isn't too bad. But, yeah, bad internet, that can still take a while. Eat something? What was that? His idol animation, he like took something out and ate it. Ah, you can kind of use that as like a double jump. Sort of. You get a, a little bit. A little bit of height. One. Need one more gem. Come on. There it is. Oh, 
I have not unlocked the horse yet. I, I don't expect him to be playable, but who knows? There's been some other surprises here, so... Maybe. This is probably what we're gonna do for the rest of the night, though, because... We're basically at the finale for, for King Knight, but I don't really want to finish it just yet. I want to save finishing it for tomorrow. Or er, Thursday, rather. Oh my god. Yeah, I don't think guys ever had a profile picture. It's just like the default Google one. I do think it changed color. I don't think you're wrong there. I've noticed that from a few people. So that must be something on YouTube's end. There was someone else, like, just earlier that I was like, that's not what color their thing used to be. I don't remember who, though. I don't, I don't like Black Knight. Also, this wind is just fucking cancer. Like, what's going on? What's going on here? Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. I think it was Logan's other account, actually. That way it was a different color than it, I think it usually is. So yeah, I don't think you're necessarily insane. You might be onto something. I don't know why they would have changed something like that, but... You know, I hope Twain doesn't hear this, but I was kind of thinking about speed trying to speedrun some of these. <laughs> Not Showdown, of course, but like some of the different campaigns. Like, just because some of those King Knight stages seem like they were built with speed in mind, I feel like it could be pretty fun. His mobility is, is a lot of fun to play with. But I also don't think I know these games well enough, so it'd be quite a, uh, quite a lot to learn. What is it that you have X on? Is it the SNES Classic? What is King Knight doing? Oh, 
Ooh, that's neat. If you hold up when you do that, he like dodges backwards. Wait, that's pretty neat. Oh, and then you can just yeet yourself off the cliff like that. So that's that's also fantastic. Yeah, I can just sacrifice myself because that's the last gem I need anyway. It only has the first X game on there, right? I mean, I guess many would argue, what more do you need? But it'd be cool if, like, X2 is on there too or something. The AI in this game is pretty funny. I'm knowing which one I am. I can't fucking hit him. Oh my god. See, that was a as soon as I pressed the button and my iframes wore off, they were like, nope, we're just gonna hit you first. We're gonna parry, or... Some such bullshit. Oh, how the fuck did you get the fuck out of here with the parries? Come on. Hey, Scarlet, welcome back. Look at that shit. Oh my god. I don't know how they do it. How do they know when I'm gonna press the button? Like, it <laughs> doesn't make sense. Got one of them though. I fight Polar Knight again. It's one big battle in an, in or out of this mirror. I chose my side, and I'm strong enough to actually protect my friends. Oh, man. Low blow. <laughs> oh my god, with the fucking parries. Fine. <laughs> Jump with the lava, see what I care. What else does he have? If I've like is there anything that I haven't figured out yet? Nope, that's pretty much it. Brant. Oh, man. 
Yeah, close enough. Oh my god. <laughs> it's embarrassing. The tree does display better than I thought it would. I I tried, like, multiple different positions for it before I settled on one last night, because I kept, like... Most of the positions I tried, it was placed, like, directly behind me, and I was like, there's no point if you can't see it. Mistake. It's also a mistake. There, that's what I wanted. It's not gonna let me stay up there, of course. Literally, as soon as I let go of the button and my invincibility frames wore off, he was on me. Justice would prevail in the end. At least he'd escaped the mirror of fate. But his friend Polar Knight, he was lost to the Enchantress. Could no one see what she truly was? He resolved to protect Shield Knight. He'd make a plan and save everyone. He just needed a little more time. House of Joust, this is a stage now. <laughs> yeah, that's... not... too weird, Volpe, but it's like, without the context, it seems weird to us, sure. Alright, what do you guys think? I have Treasure Knight left, Enchantress, Baz, 
Dark Rise, and the Liquid Samurai. I'm thinking Baz, because he's like the first one I unlocked, and he's just been getting neglected the whole time. But if you guys really want to see any of the other characters, I'll go ahead and I'll do those next. Yeah, if I had to guess, there's three more. I don't immediately know who they'd be, but... The Baz stared blankly at the landscape. He swore he wasn't here a minute ago. It felt like a wizard was poking him in the brain. <laughs> it had to be a setup. Baz cracked his knuckles. He knew a rumble when he saw one. Yeah, I don't, I'm not even sure, like, which characters are left. Well, there's Hat Guy, which is right there, so we're probably gonna get him. There's probably Normal Rise? Raze? Whatever his name is? Like, you, you can probably get the normal version of him. Nah. Oh my god, I almost yeeted myself into the lava. Well, that's fun. Alright, what, what else can he do? B while in the air, elbow drop while in the air, whiplash electro. Alright, so he's, he's pretty simple. <laughs> Fucking elbow drop. Seriously? Why is he like a wrestler, but he has a whip? the connection there. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, I can do it too. Oh my god. The fucking bomb, are you serious? I see 10 likes. Do up some pixels super quick. Got bullied. Oh my god, are you serious? What, you mean like fan remixes? I think there was like an official remix album, like, after the first game came out too. I was dead anyway, so that one's kind of okay, I guess. has an exit. Hello, hello, oh, no hat. Shame, shame indeed. Ah, but wait a moment. I know you. I fitted you for the armor you're wearing now. Yes, yes, you were in my shop. You didn't pay. Uh-oh. <laughs> Looks like 
Look, I was counting on a signing bonus with the order, but uh, it's complicated. There are only two things that truly anger me. One is going hatless, the other is being stolen from. <laughs> He has a fucking flex as his taunt. Why does their parry last for like a year and a half? My last, mine lasts like never long enough. So he has like a form change kind of thing. That's interesting. I feel like he's gonna be an interesting character to play as. <laughs> A lot of bombs. What's the point of, of that? That's, oh, okay, that works. <laughs> I was questioning this bouncing attack. Does that like actually deal damage? Super. music but I, I guess I'd need to know what you mean by messy oh guys lost so many jabs yeah very well Man, I did have, like, eight gems at one point. To eight, we're just gonna stay alive. So bad it's good music? Do you mean like the Game Boy version of Mega Man 2? Is that kind of what you're talking about? Like, noisy music?
kind of depends, I guess. Sometimes yes, sometimes no. Oh man, the yawns hit so suddenly. Whew. Fucking parry, I hate it. Oh my god. Oh, it's because we're on big hit, that's right. Okay. You fucking... Alright. Yikes. Died at the last second. That could have been catastrophic. <laughs> That hit me. Whatever. Throw it in the lava. I missed the platform, are you shitting me? Zelda 1? Have you ever played it before? Did you- are you all finished with Pokemon and Dragon Quest? Oh. My. God. Okay. That was all a thing. You fucking troll. Come on. I'm looking forward to playing, streaming, like, doing Pokemon raids and stuff tomorrow. Because I haven't really sat down and played that in a while. And now that my Gigantamaxes are all, like, trained, I feel like it's going to go a lot smoother. 
Although I want to level them up a bit. They're all level 70. I don't want to level them to 100 because I feel like that might make things too easy. It probably doesn't though. It's probably designed around people using level 100s, but still. I might only level them up to 80. Got wrecked. Oh, you like don't like time travel stuff? I'm eager to do post game, it's just. I want to make sure I have the time to commit to it. I'm prepared to offer you mercy and a job in my fancy shop to repay your debt. We'd only destroy the mirror that binds us here in endless battle. What do you say, friend? Oh, you think the Baz is gonna work in some stinky old hat store? You're out of your mind. I don't wear aprons or sweep floors, especially for the man. I punch faces, not clocks. <laughs> it's just saying, I'm pretty sure after I'm done with you, you won't even remember my debt. I wouldn't even say get a decent map, I'd say map it yourself. That's what I did when I played Zelda 1, and I think it, like, really added to the experience. Would you stop it? <laughs> oh, I didn't like go very far in post games, so maybe I don't know what I'm getting myself into fully. They might have been speaking in hypotheticals, though, because that's, like, always a risk with time travel, right? Is that you might fuck something up. <sighs> yeah, I love doing self-mapping on, like, old games. I did that for the original Metroid as well, which helped... ...a bit. The original Metroid's kind of punishing, though, so it didn't, like, completely help. Even sometimes I knew where I was going, and it was still, like, just kind of a mess. I saw the gem, and I was like, I'm gonna go get the gem. I completely ignored the fucking... Yeah, but I guess I'd encourage, like, if it's if it's a basically blind playthrough, I'd encourage, like, preserving that experience. Although I know when I played it blind, I did have to look one thing up, because some of the dungeons are really obscurely hidden. With, like, no hints about where they may or may not be. Some of the later ones in particular. Yeah, I thought the earlier dungeons were fine, but the later ones are, like, 
How the hell are you supposed to know where this shit is? That's actually pretty close. Oh, you've watched people play it. Sweeping is tougher than it looks. Baz mopped the sweat from his brow. Mr. Head had not, for had not forgotten the debt, but at least now it was finally repaid. Fancy shops sparkled and gleamed. Baz high-fived his cleanup crew. It was nice to be a part of something. Good time to be a free agent, Baz mused. He had no need for the order. Whoever needed him, that would be his team. Mr. Hat. Uh, there might only be one more, because there's probably gonna be a slot for random, right? Yeah. I think there's gonna be one for random. There's- I think there's only gonna be one more character. Could be two, but I'm expecting just one. And it's probably the light version of this guy, if I had to guess. In fact, we're just gonna do him next. So, yeah, it's his default. What do you mean, Scarlet? wave pulsed through Ray's as he regained his consciousness. Had that foolish puppet Spectre Knight warped him here? He felt the enchanted magic nearby. This would be his chance to please her. Ray's drew his energy boomerang, gleeful at the prospect of havoc. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in that game that's like, how are you supposed to naturally discover this stuff? The hell? Okay, so he has like a Meta Knight teleport. He has a... He's got the, the chic down air. Also, do that. What's that do? Oh. Oh, if you press it again, it projectiles away.
Oh god, he has full health. Oh, fly away. Give me that chicken. Oh, I guess I get you. Could you go patch Mega Man 6 and take out the shitty dropped inputs? <laughs> and maybe the bad, like, the bad menus. I think it sucks is like then of course you can't like you couldn't speed run it like I'd still have to speed run the original shoddy version that makes me want to fucking delete my game. Oh he just always throws it down in the air that's a little unfortunate. I don't completely love that. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. I hit him. The fuck? <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, well there he is. Where'd that gem go? Oh. To say, is it just gone for, for gone forever? It's unfortunate. I was prepared for the swap, I wasn't prepared for the bomb being there. Oh man, he's gonna be good at this.
except for the fact that he can't throw his boomerang unless he's on the ground. Minor inconvenience. That's a lot of points. The points from the apple <laughs> put me over? Really? Okay. This is the one I hate. Yeah, because they all just have a billion lives. Oh, he can grab walls? Okay. Again? Is this all we got is like the, the mirror things? Fucking lo I think I just lost because of that. Oh my god, I definitely lost because of that. No, because they died as much as I did, so I guess we're okay. Yeah, it's almost weird, right? I feel like she's normal person sized and everybody else is like not normal person sized. Oh god. Oh god. Yeah, you can just fucking climb walls, okay. Fucking team. Alright. Yeah, give me them gems. Now nah, we're talking. Yes. Alright, we're in pretty good shape now. For a second, they were just, like, piling on each other, so whenever one of them died, the other ones just immediately picked up the gems. It's causing a bit of a problem. We're all right now. Does it even have a save? I don't remember. It's been a long time since I played the first one. That's a lot of shields. That's a lot of shields. Bum, bum. 
How'd that? Oh, it did hit her. Okay. For a second, it didn't. It was just like there. That bomb hit me? I didn't know that explosions could screen wrap. I was pretty sure they couldn't. Oh, you... okay. Well, that was stupid. Got him. What just happened? <laughs> Whatever happened, it just happened again. I guess she just blocked me. Man, I can't decide which version of this character is worse. <laughs> they're, they're both really bad for, really, for for very different reasons. One's stupidly edgy and the other one's stupidly cringe. I don't think you need a second controller to do it. Raise is not adorable. <sighs> That's true, I think it might save whenever you finish a dungeon, too. Well, what are you playing it on, Volpe? Because if it's on Switch, you can just use the save states as a save supplement. Unless you very specifically only want to save the, the intended way, which I would totally understand. I don't think it's 
necessarily cheating. I think it can be. I think if you're just, like, saving after a dungeon, I don't think that's a bad thing. Now, I think they call it save scumming. And that's the shit where you clear a screen, save, clear a screen, save, clear a screen. Like, that's, that's the shit where I'm like, no, no, fuck that. That's just... But I think using them in moderation, or even as a, well, I want to put the game down, and I don't want to have to start over later, I think that's fine, too. I used that in Metroid when I was playing that, like, a couple months ago. I kind of, like, made checkpoints for myself. I didn't just use it whenever the hell, but whenever I, like, felt like... I'd use it at, like, the beginning of a new area. as, like, just a checkpoint and be like, okay, so now if I die, I go back to the start of this area instead of... Which I think the game does that anyway, but... I think they're very contextual. I don't think it's all necessarily bad. Just some people, yeah, they'll... They'll get past an enemy and save state, and then beat the next enemy and save state, and I'm like, no, no, no. Like, uh-uh. Nope. God, th he's so fucking edgy. That was like barely an ending. With that, I think I know which character's worse. I'm pretty sure Dark Rays is worse. Pretty sure Dark Rays is worse. I do kind of feel like there's gonna be one more. No clue who it would be, but... It's gonna be something sidey. It's probably gonna be the horse. Uh, <laughs> um... like the default one. Maybe a little too pink. Maybe a little too blue, that's not bad. Raze? Yeah, he's... He, he's a side character. All four of those are side characters, but then in Plague Knight's story, he kind of, like, has a bigger role. And that's when it... When he becomes this fucking edgelord. I guess I could try to do one more, and then it might be around time to call it quits anyway, so... I guess let's get this guy out of the way. Actually, I'm kind of thinking we're gonna go start a Shovel Knight clear. I think that's what we're actually gonna do. I don't, I don't necessarily feel like doing another one of those, so... 
I think what we're gonna do is start. The, the vanilla story. Oops. Yes! Maybe? Do I? You could just randomize it. Easily opposite, do opposite, or you can set them on an individual basis. So you can access it from in-game. I was just gonna set it back to default, actually. Yeah. We're gonna just do it default for this one, I think. Otherwise, I will be plagued with indecision. And will waste a bunch of time, so. Yeah, you can do it at any time in the pause menu, so. Can always change my mind later if I if I so choose. I'm missing like an entire heirloom. Yeah, they made a gender swap for the original game. Long ago, the lands were untamed and roamed by legendary adventurers. I think King Knight started the same way. Of all heroes, none shone brighter than Shovel Knight and Shield Knight. But their travels together ended at the Tower of Fate when a cursed amulet wrought a terrible magic. When Shovel Knight awoke, the tower was sealed and Shield Knight was gone. Spirit broken, a grieving Shovel Knight went into a life of solitude. But without, but without champions, the land was seized by a vile power, the Enchantress and her order of no quarter. Now the tower is unsealed, and devastation looms. A new adventure is about to begin. Already feels classic. It's only been like six years, and I'm already like, yeah, this is this is that classic. I think that'd be the hard part about speedrunning this, is like, ignoring treasure. I don't want to ignore the treasure, I want all of it. Alright. 
Yeah, it's pretty solid, like, beginner track. Strong way to start the game. Yeah, I decided not to get too OCD about it. I, I'm kind of curious to see, like, how far I can get before before we stop for the night. Though I'm not feeling, like, too an antsy about stopping, so we might not stop, like, right at 1. We might go for an extra half an hour or something. I'm not super hungry or anything, so... For some reason, I didn't see him. They do give you a, a good deal of food. And treasure. Care more about the treasure. Let me tell you, it's a good thing Mega Man games don't have, like, treasure, because then I'd never be able to do them fast. I'm already thinking trying to do this fast would be a bad idea, because, like, I can't help but be like, ooh, secrets. I gotta get all the things. Well, that was stupid. The dragon pit? Oh, you mean, like, the one underneath that second one? You could, you could do, like, a 100%. 100% would be tough, because you'd have to grind money to be able to get, like, all the upgrades. Like, that would just be unfortunate. No, 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 there we go. Feet accomplished, I'm alive! I don't know what that is. Because I didn't die the whole stage? 
probably? Hey view, how's it going? No, I made it... I think I'm at, like, the last area. Oh, and I was like, I, I could have beaten it tonight, but I was like, I don't want to. I want it to last, so I was like, eh, we'll do that on Thursday. I went and did Showdown for a little bit, and then I came and did this. How did it go for you today? I wanted to tune in, but... I was, I was saying earlier in the stream, I muted my phone this morning. Because I'm sick of being woken up by solicitors. Um, and as a result, I massively overslept. Because nothing woke me up. Always, always put the fire out. Always put the fire out. But I don't wanna. <laughs> no weapons. Oh, that's just a shovel. I wouldn't mind some extra health. Oh, right, right, you have to... Why did they decide that you had to do this in this particular manner? I guess because you can get these for free sometimes. Yeah, we'll get two. Fuck it. Gimme. Oh, cool, he cooked both of them. Mmm, health. Oh, I have to get relics first, okay. Oh, uh, I could do Spectre first. Oh, you have to buy those. And those. The fishing rod is, like, really fucking useful. So is the orb, really. Um. Why is Spectre first, like, harder? this later when I have a little bit more money to spare showdown is like I like it and I think it's super ambitious which is cool there's some things I don't care for parrying is bullshit for example <laughs> And the AI input reads like fucking crazy, and it makes me mad. No, I probably won't beat this tonight. I'm all, I'm only planning on going for like... I might go for another half an hour. Maybe. No, but I kind of want to. I kind of want to do an amiibo playthrough at some point too. Um. All right. Well, Scarlet thinks I can't. I th th thinks Spectre's gonna be too hard without relics. So, uh, I, th I think I think we gotta we gotta show her what's what. I know there are some stages where they hide stuff to the left.
Oh no. Come here. No, come here. No, 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 come here. No, I can't jump high enough with that. Oh, there we go. Saved it. You can't, like, fully go in whatever order, but, well, I fucked that up. I'm not bad. Um, but you can, like... You have options. It's not, like, you can't pick from all eight from the start of the game, but... In this particular case, I have two options, for example. Was this the first checkpoint? I don't know if I want to, if I want to dare, dare to do that. There's an achievement for beating a stage with that while breaking every checkpoint. I don't know if I want to do that. I'm not that confident. Pretty fucking confident, but I'm not that confident. Yes, yeah, Spectre's a little bit more non-linear, if I recall correctly. After we do Shovel and King, I'll probably do Spectre after that. I only ever played Spectre once. And we'll see if I actually go for Plague. I wasn't a big fan of Plague. Fuck. But I want the fucking treasure. Oh, the... Frogs came back, fuck it. Fuck, fuck the treasure. Fuck the treasure confirmed. Or is the achievement only to destroy one checkpoint? Can I check them? I can check them. Never mind. Specs a sexually fish. Five sparks. Finish the game without spending any money? Fuck you. <laughs> I guess that's probably not that hard. Finishing it without dying or taking damage, you can actually get fucked. I don't know. Uh-uh. Destroy every possible checkpoint. Finish the game without falling into a pit. Maybe. I thought there was one that just defeat a stage without using a checkpoint. Beat the game without collecting any relics. Finish the game within an hour and thirty. See, I think I could do that. Destroy all checkpoints and finish a single stage. I think I can do that at some point. I don't think I'd go for all of the achievements in this game because of ridiculous shit like finish the game without getting hit. Like, I'm not interested in putting myself through that. That doesn't sound fun. But beat the game in an hour 30 minutes I think I could probably do that especially if you can do it on new game plus there's a level without eating any food that's don't collect any gold yikes it's annoying Use caution and common sense around campfires. Yep, I did that. I feel like a lot of these would be fun to speedrun. I'm tempted. A 
and it would probably be a good way to to uh, pers persuade Twain into to picking the games up and playing them too. So, <laughs> yeah, I'm not a fan of don't take damage. Mostly because, like, okay, on a stage, all right, the entire game get fucked. On one stage is kind of like, oh, all right, it's not too big of a deal. But doing it through the whole game is very one wrong move and you you lose hours of sometimes hours of progress. Like, uh uh. Nope. <laughs> Yeah, exactly, but that's that's the thing is like some stages are gonna be easier than others. The whole game, that's just a big fuck you. Like <laughs> Oh, I don't think the frog is heavy enough to count, actually. I could see myself doing something with this game where I'm like, I'll go for 75% of the achievements or something like that. Like, I would set a number and just be like, like, like that's, that's what we'll do. But I'm not going for all of them when it includes shit like, don't get hit. Like, yeah, no. Pass. Oh yeah, here's a locket that you can use to walk through all those all these enemies. Oh, you killed them. Never mind. Oh, I goofed on that. You know, I've had that happen so many times. You think I would have like seen it coming and and been like, "Hey, maybe I should not let this happen." Nope. Like that skeleton in particular is such a fucking troll. Isn't there another path down here? I thought there was. I might be remembering incorrectly. Oh, 
Very blind. That's unfortunate. <laughs> that is unfortunate. How did I not hit him? Excuse me? Disagree with that. Oh my god, I fucking bonked on the platform, you've gotta be kidding me. That's not what I meant to do. Whatever, we out. Oh my god, I keep accidentally using that. Can you change that? Yeah, now we're talking. Yeah, put it on A instead. Thank you very much. I wonder why they... I don't, I don't even remember up and why being a thing. I'm not a fan, though. I'm getting fucking destroyed. P.S. Been spoiled by the fact that King Knight drops like a billion health. Oh, that sucked. Well played. They didn't give me R as an option. I guess because now you can switch them with L and R? Maybe you'd have to turn that off? I don't know. Yeah, I've picked up a few health, uh, health upgrades already. Missed one, but that's alright. 
Fuck you. That was ugly. <laughs> yeah, you don't necessarily get weapons from beating the knights, but you do get stuff from their stage. I don't know if you're still poking around, View, but I also hate about Showdown, about the hit stun is unreal. And a lot of the times I die just because they smack me and I go flying into a pit, and there's nothing I can do about it, which enrages me, like, every single time. Between that and, like, how they input read with parries, those are, like, the two things I really can't stand. So much music to unlock. Um, okay. Is it this, like, actually really hard to do? Bring it back here. Let me try that again. Where'd you go? Oh no! Oh, I got it. Okay, good. <laughs> Yay, achievement. Thought I messed it up at the last second and I was super sad. because those are pretty nice to have. I'm not going to get both of them. We're also going to get this, because it's good. Uh, I think we'll go do, like, we'll go do King Knight stage. That should put us around five and a half hours, and we can call it quits. Now I feel, like, more ready to stop than I did before. Oh, this is the one, isn't it? Yeah. I was gonna say, any time now. Juice, I a I'd ask that you don't refer to it as that. Because <laughs> that makes it sound super gross. Not that Iker is a very appealing name either, but... I'm noticing that King Knight stages are a lot more forgiving in terms of, like... A lot of Shovel Knight stages, if you mess up a platforming section, you kind of only get one chance. Like, if it's for a secret or something. Mm 
I saw there was an achievement to reflect projectiles to get kills, so... Boink! <laughs> Boink! Attention, I didn't see that was there. <laughs> yeah, sure. Man, I'm rich already. Damn. You find a lot more treasure as, as Shovel Knight. Maybe I'm just bad at finding treasure with King Knight. I don't know. Or I'm spending it very quickly. That's another option, I guess. I don't think I can hit him with this anyway, because of the angle. Boink. Boink. Myself. I think I might have. I think I might have. I think I might have dumbed. I thought I was being smart, but apparently I was being dumb. And they don't respawn. That's fantastic. Can you really not make this jump? Like, I feel like you should be able to. Yeah, you can. Never mind. I was just being bad and messing it up. One of them pixel perfect jumps. But if I go down, I'm gonna lose my my my, 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 my secrets. Oh, there's not much of a secret here anyway. Never mind. Okay. <laughs> No, Volpe. I have actually wanted to. I used to be really into Adventure Time.
More treasure. More secrets. Oh yeah, if I would have destroyed that last one, I would have been screwed, but that's exactly why I didn't destroy it, because I was pretty sure if I kept that one that I'd be okay. Yeah, as I pointed out while playing King Knight, oh, I messed up on that, but that's alright. Um, the stages are way shorter, but they're also... There's more of them. Like, these stages are way longer, but... There's probably only like 12 stages or something like that, maybe like 16 or somewhere around there. Yeah, don't go don't go thinking that I didn't know what I was doing. I'm I am low key insulted that you that you'd think I would make such a mistake. That was almost bad. <laughs> right after I give the confidence speech, right? I almost make a huge error. That's typical. Thank you. I don't really want the invincibility though. Oh, I wanted like a healing thing. Oh, I can't like bring those up on. Yeah, fuck it. I'm just gonna use it. Ooh, that was almost bad. <laughs> Gotta love the Griffin's like unimpressed claw. So we don't know how he winds up in charge here. We haven't found that out yet. I have a feeling we're gonna get to the final boss of King Knight and he's just and she's gonna make him a bargain and he's just gonna be like, okay. <laughs> like at the last sec at the last minute, like ending screen, he's gonna be like, Yeah, sure, I'll work for you. If it means I get like I'm actually a king? Alright. We never get that ground slam thing. We do get the dash, though. Never got the confetti, either. But I guess we still have a ways to go, so. It kind of... The game's making it look like there's only, like, three stages left, but I have a feeling it's more complicated than that. Do 
do do do do If I remember right, in the speedrun they intentionally lose this because they can use that time to get money instead. I think I watched a speedrun of this, but it was a while ago, and it might be they might have it might have changed a lot by now. But I seem to remember them like letting her fall because you can use that time to get money instead. Yeah, that's comfortable comfortable for now. On Thursday we'll probably continue. Yeah. Do that. I might go ahead and buy some more health too. If I have the money, let's just go ahead and max it out, right? That's the last one. The others are all from campfires, like that one we just got. Pretty sure. I don't really use relics a lot, so I'm gonna wait to do that. I'm gonna save money so that instead we can get, like, can get a different armor or something later. And yeah, like I said, I'll probably do two clears through through Shovel Knight. I'll probably do one as the Amiibo, too. That's pretty interesting, because you, like, level up and everything and unlock new stuff. Like, instead of finding the relics in the stages, you, like, yeah, you get them by leveling up. Get different, like, armor appearances and shit, so... Yeah, we'll probably do one of those, too. I, I started one of those a long time ago, but I never finished it. It was probably a better idea to go with the bottom route. Oh, still got some of it. Yeah, I think when they added the Amiibo stuff, I did a run. But yeah, like I said, I never finished it. Ugh, but I remember it was fun, because I, I think he gets some of his own abilities, too. So you get some pretty crazy stuff that you can do. But yeah, that's a comfortable amount of clearage for tonight, so I'm happy stopping there. Um, we'll come back on Thursday, we'll finish King Knight. We'll probably finish beating Showdown with every character. Um, and then we'll probably come back and continue with this. Probably finish this on that night, too. Um, man, I have this one person that I always want to raid, but they always have a ton of people watching. And that, like, discourages me. Oh, like, speedrun routes? Yeah, I think I've only ever watched, like, one speedrun of this game. Oh. Uh, but yeah, that's gonna be it for tonight. Let me drop a few pixels. Um, as I said, we're gonna do some Pokemon raids tomorrow. I'll probably finish up my Pokedex, maybe. Hopefully. Um, I think a lot of that is going to come down to finding the last exclusives I need. 
I need like three exclusives from Shield. Um, and some of them are like kind of hard to come by, so I have a feeling some of them might be kind of a pain in the ass. Um, yeah, otherwise we're probably just gonna do raids all night. So anyone who wants to join in on that, you're obviously welcome. Um, and then we'll come back to this on Thursday. Like I said, we'll probably finish King Knight and the showdown story mode with all the characters. Um, I don't know how much more of it... I, I mean, the nice thing about showdown is you can kind of just, like... If I... I, I can just kind of sprinkle it through the rest of the playthrough. I can just kind of be like, well, we got a lot done here, let's go do a couple showdown things, and then, like, there's just a lot of content in this game, so I think I'm gonna keep doing that, I'm just gonna kind of mix it up, and just... I'm just gonna brand the series as Shovel Knight Treasure Trove, and we're just gonna do everything in here. And we're just gonna bounce around and do all sorts of stuff. Because this is one of those games where I've really liked it, but I've never put in as much time as I've wanted to. So this seems like a good opportunity to do so. Um, and this will probably be our, th our Thursday night game for a bit instead of Mega Man. I think this is gonna kinda... kinda take over. We'll see how much we can get out of it. Um, I don't know what I'm doing on Friday just yet. I will be streaming, but I don't know what I'm gonna be playing. Um, I'm currently leaning towards just playing Monster Hunter. I might talk myself into trying to do another Dauntless stream, but Monster Hunter's a little bit safer, I think. Um, Saturday, we'll do more Risk of Rain. Sunday, we'll do Monster Hunter. And then next week's Christmas, so I have to finish figuring out what we're going to do that week. I don't know what I'm going to do on Monday. I was planning on not taking off, but I don't know what I'm going to stream. If I stream, I might talk to Twain about doing more more speedrun races over with him. Um, but then Tuesday we're going to do the Mega Man 1 through 6 run. And I don't know what I'm doing on Wednesday yet either. I am planning on streaming, though. Um... Yeah, that's about it. Um... I don't think we have too much to... I'm dropping frames all of a sudden. What's going on? Never mind. It's alright. Um, yeah, I agree. I think this this can be kind of a variety hour kind of stream. We can kind of just do things. I think it'll be fun. I'm looking forward to it. I'm going to try and focus a little bit more, though. Like... I don't know, I guess I like doing King Knight the way I have been, where I've been like, okay, this section of stages is done, so I'm gonna do something else for a little bit, and then we'll come back to this on the next day. That's been comfortable for me, at least, because then I don't burn through it too quickly. If I would have focused just on King Knight, I probably would have done it in, like, two streams, maybe three. I mean, no, definitely two, because if I would have pushed tonight, we would have easily beaten it. So... We'll beat it on Thursday, though, for sure. And I might do new game plus playthroughs of a bunch of this stuff. Who knows? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna wing it and have fun. Um, I think I'm gonna skip the raid. I think I'm gonna skip the raid because I mostly just want to go make something to eat. Let me refresh really quick. And see if I have an option that makes me go, oh no, hold on, we're gonna go do this. Yeah, not really. See, so yeah, I think I'm gonna skip that tonight. Um, but as always, thank you everyone for hanging out and enjoying the experience with me. Um, like I said, I've been, this is one of those games that I really, like I funded it on Kickstarter way back, the original thing, the original project. Haven't regretted it, but despite liking it so much, I've never put in nearly as much time as I've wanted to, so this is my opportunity to finally do that, and I'm looking forward to doing more of that, so. Um. Hey, Officer Dan, how's it going? Are you guys not streaming tonight? I find that unusual. You said Shinja wasn't feeling well, though, right? I hope he's feeling better. Uh, uh, yeah, thank you everyone for hanging out. Um... Like I said, I'll see you guys tomorrow for some Pokemon. I'll see you again on Thursday for this. And yeah, overall, I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.